Welcome to another Spread Cheaters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spread Cheaters website. In this video, we're going to see how to compare two columns in different Excel sheets using VLOOKUP. Comparing columns in two different Excel sheets is something that you will need to do frequently when working with datasets. In this example, I have two worksheets from two different sales executives, one called Mary and one called George, and they each have submitted a list of the customers with the customer code and the customer name. Now, I want to compare these two columns, which is the customer name or the customer uh, code, in both these sheets. To do this, I will use the VLOOKUP function. Now, to explain how it works, we will just directly dive into the example. So here now on the sheet that uh, labeled Mary, I will create a column called names from George. So what I'm going to do is compare the customer code from both sheets because this is uh, what is going to be unique. Now the VLOOKUP function, for the first argument, I have to select what I'm going to look up. And in this case, it is the customer code. I then need to specify where I want to look up this code which in this case is the George sheet. So I then go to George sheet and I select customer code and customer name. I select both columns and then I want to specify what value I want returned from this table. In this case, even though I'm comparing customer code, I want the customer name to be returned. So I'll select two since I want the second column to be returned. The final argument is whether I want an approximate or an exact match. So in this case, I want an exact match. So I'll say false and press enter. Now, as you can see, an error value is returned. Now this is because most probably this customer code does not exist on the George sheet. Now before copying this formula down, I just need to make it constant by selecting the cell reference and pressing F4. Because I want to look up the rest of the values in this sheet, in the entire George table. So now that I've done that, I can drag this down to the rest of the column. And as you can see, where there are matches, the name is displayed, and where are the, there aren't any matches, an error message is displayed. So I will do a similar exercise on the George sheet because there may be names on the George sheet that are not in the Mary sheet. So let's go to the George sheet and do the same thing. Here I have names from Mary. I will Again, create VLOOKUP here. In this case, again, I'm selecting the customer code. But in this case, I'm going to look up in the Mary sheet. So here I'll go again, select the data and type 2 because again, I want the name displayed and say false. Now, before copying this down, I have to make the references constant by pressing F4 and enter. And now I can drag this down. And now again, I've got the names that match and the names that don't. So of course, it stands to reason that the names that match in this sheet will be the same as the names that match in the Mary sheet. But this helps me identify which customers are missing from the Mary sheet but are displayed on the uh, George sheet. So this is how you can compare two columns in different Excel sheets using VLOOKUP. Please read the appended article for further guidance.